Okay, today we're going to be back on my Omni turn making some more Cricut locomotive parts. These are the axle bearings that go in the chassis. They take three operations to form. As you can see, I've done a couple hundred of the first operation. For filming, I'll be running this without oil, so I'll be running a little slower speed than usual. Only three tools will be used for the first operation. A grooving tool that I use for front turning and back turning to create the profile. Then a parting tool in order to cut off the part. And then, of course, the bar puller to pull the bar out. <laughs> Okay, we're going to do the second operation on these little cricket bearings. I'm using four tools. I've got to spot drill it, drill it, and then ream it to 126 thousandths. And I already owned an ID boring tool and had the right size for the um, snap ring groove. So I mounted it upside down to turn the OD. I have to run the spindle in reverse. So the start of the process is to run the spindle in reverse, cut the ring groove, and profile the part. And then spot drill it, drill it, ream it, and spit it out. Let's make a part. Okay, here's the third operation, the cross drilling. This allows oil to be fed to the axle. And here's some of the finished bearings with the cross-drilled oil hole. <laughs> 